All right, guys. So for number one, we're going to say write down your goals. If they're just in your head, it's really hard to remember them. Goals change. It's hard to think about them and focus on them every day. Um, if you've listened to our previous episodes, we talk about how in the morning is when your brain is, you know, it's the best time to absorb the information and get ready for each day, um, get in the right mindset, if you will, to what your goals are that day and move forward. Um, so it's great to write them down every morning, read them. When you're doing your gratitude list, you read your gratitude list, um, see those goals and read those as well. Um, and then it's just a lot easier to focus on those and strive towards those on a daily basis. Here's a great example. Say I'm on a free 30 minute discovery call with a potential client and I say, all right, well, what's your goal? That person's going to say one of two things. <clears throat> They're either going to say, I want to lose some fat or I want to build some muscle. That's one thing they can say. Or and at that point in my head, I'm thinking, all right, you've put absolutely no thought into this whatsoever. So when I get a call like that and someone says, you know what, I want to lose some fat, I want to build some muscle, I want to tone up a little bit, that tells me, all right, you've put absolutely no thought into this whatsoever. But if I get on that same call and I say, all right, well, what's your goal? And they say, all right, well, right now I'm 240 pounds, uh, I'm 22% body fat, I want to get down to single digit body fat. So taking that into account, I have to lose 50 pounds of fat. I want to put on 10 pounds of muscle. How do I go about doing that? Be specific with your goals. Exactly. So that's when I know, all right, this guy's actually put some thought into this and we can benchmark some goals to see if you're on track. Because if you want to lose 40 pounds in the next six months, well, you're going to not just want to hit the six month mark and say, all right, did I lose 40 pounds or didn't I? You want to have little micro goals set in between that. 